Hey guys, I am in the hotel for the first night. I didn't get quite as much driving done as I would have liked. I started a little late this morning because it was raining and trying to get everything into my car was just kind of a pain and that just took a little bit longer than I wanted it to. And then, of course, when I was driving, it was raining pretty heavy as well. So that slowed down everything. There really wasn't any traffic on the roads, but just the fact that it was raining so hard and there was lots of fog and stuff just, you know, slowed everything down. So I didn't get quite as much done as I wanted to. I'm in Virginia right now. I have no idea what part of Virginia, but I'm in Virginia. So I'm thinking that it's probably going to take me all day tomorrow and then maybe a little bit of the next day. So the cats seem to be doing well, though. They didn't eat at all or drink anything, I don't think. Um, so I'm trying to get them to eat and drink now. Um, but they're still, you know, kind of in a state of shock. Uh, let me show you. How you doing? You doing okay? Huh? Where's the other one? Hey, how you doing? You want to come up? Hey. Hey. Talking to you. Hey. <laughs> she doesn't care. You doing okay? Huh? Yeah. Anyways, they uh they did well. You know, the uh this blob right here just stayed in the back. After like the first six, seven hours or something like that, uh, this one decided to jump in the front and sit on my lap for the rest of the drive. So that was kind of interesting. <laughs> uh, she gets a lot more scared than, than that one does. But anyway, so I've got their food set up and a little litter box thing. Thankfully, all these beds have that underneath because if they didn't then it would be like a massive massive pain to get these cats out from underneath the bed in the morning so I'm really happy that they have that stuff there uh, in fact that's one of the things that delayed me this morning was that one was hiding underneath my bed and it took me like 15 minutes to get her out and then trying to get them both into the cat carrier at the same time is a project so anyways i think i'm going to call it a night go to sleep and try to get up uh, really early i'd like to get up at like six or seven and hit the road as soon as it's daylight and just keep going as much as i can tomorrow and then uh what is what is today today's tuesday so Wednesday, I'm thinking I should I'm thinking I should arrive sometime Thursday. Now, I'm hoping that I arrive early enough in the day that the people for the apartment are actually there so I can get the key. Because if I arrive late, like 7 or 8 o'clock at night or even later, uh, they're not going to be in the office and I won't be able to get my key. So I'll, I, funny enough, I'll have to find a hotel near my apartment in order to uh, spend that last night but anyways like I said I'm gonna wrap it up for tonight I was going to upload the other videos that I recorded but there isn't any Wi-Fi here or it's or if it does work it's like just unbearably slow so it wouldn't even it's not even worth it anyways all right day one complete